welcome back to the Sarah and Sydney show. <laughs> it's pouring rain right now, but we're determined. <laughs> we're going snowboarding! Yeah! The place we're going is like 45 minutes away. It's in Connecticut. Um, hopefully it'll be okay. I was looking at the weather and it says that it's snowing there all day. It's gonna be snowing pretty hard. So, hopefully we have a good time. I wore the wrong shoes because it's like slushy outside right now and my socks are wet. But you know what? It's gonna be worth it at the end, right? By the time we get there, it should be snowing, so. Should be snowing? Yeah. And when we're out up on the mountain, it's gonna be pretty cold anyways. Yeah. Before we start driving, are there any like super beginner tips that you have? Oh yeah, she's gonna teach me how to snowboard. This is my first time snowboarding ever. I've never even stepped foot on a snowboard before. Have you skied? When I was like five. Okay, you know how like you like go on the um, different sides of the different edges of the ski yeah. to like turn and yeah. whatnot. And obviously skiing is a lot different, but um, the different edges of a snowboard have different like purposes. So the edge closest to your heel is like, um, <clears throat> that's for stopping and that's for going, I mean if you're left foot forward then um, it's for going left. And okay. the t edge um, under your toes is for going right. Okay. So the hardest thing for most people to get is, um, is to basically go on their toes, purely yeah. because it's like, it's just new. And, um, it feels like you're falling forward. A little bit. I can, yeah, I can picture that. Um, so, I mean, once you get used to it, you get used to it. But I, I'm also speaking from like years of doing this. Yeah. So, I mean, I guess I'll try and teach you. I'll give you a rundown of it before, like we actually go on to any bunny soap, and then I'll show you how it is. Okay. That sounds good. Okay, it's gonna be a wild adventure. Hopefully, we don't skid out on the highway and, you know, <laughs> end up in a ditch. Let's go! It's pretty empty. The parking lot is... kind of empty. Here's the gear. I'm just gonna put this like this for now. That's yeah, it's fine. Very Struggling a lot. Here's the boots. I got a rental. These are the boots that I got. Oh, those are the easy strap ins. Yeah. Dang it. I was hoping you had laces. <laughs> Why? I don't so okay, so you can, can watch me struggle. Pain. Oh. <laughs> my white helmet and cute pink goggles. I really wanted pink ones so I found one on Amazon. Very cute. Take all your straps and you get them out the hell out of the way. <laughs> Take your foot and you fit it in here like that. You make sure it's all the way back. The, and so that way you can... Basically, you, just, you shouldn't be able to really move your foot. Okay. So push this in like that and you tighten until you can't anymore. Do the same for over here. Tighten. So you can't anymore. Okay. You're all set. good. I've been struggling the last hour. Huh? Learning how to stand. Didn't realize it would be this bad, but. I'm gonna take a break and Sydney's gonna go 
down the hill. This learning hill. <laughs> Bye. What a pro. That was so fast. Oh my god. I think that's her. On the little snow snowboard escalator. Even I have trouble standing up sometimes. Like this isn't oh, really? this isn't new. Yeah. Like, um like even like the other time other day I had a little bit of trouble. And that's just because like the how the board is and how your weight and uh, like how the slope is sometimes it's icy standing up is hard man yeah, it's hard. that's like the hardest thing and it's just like if you say you can't you can like if you just say that i'm bad and all that stuff's okay but like really it's just Yeah. <laughs> All right, try, try, try straightening it out a little bit. Yep. Now stop. You see the whole process? Final run down this mountain before we go. has concluded we're about to go get some burgers because nothing works up your appetite for burgers like snowboarding <laughs> um what did you think of the lesson my teacher ah uh, you make good progress yeah i couldn't even stand the first hour <laughs> that was really hard because i was afraid because i kept moving forward and I didn't want to like, you know, just like run willy nilly down the hill because I would just die. I just knew I was going to die. So eventually I got over that. Yeah, you were a good teacher. You were a good teacher. So that was, it was fun. I had a good time. But like in the beginning I saw that like little mountain and I thought that it was like huge. <laughs> it looked like Everest to me. 
I was like, I'm never gonna get down. But like the more we went down it, and the faster I got, like the smaller it became. It took like no time at all to get down that mountain. That's crazy. But yeah, it was fun. Did you have fun? Yeah, I had fun. It was funny. You were very patient. <laughs> I think that that was really good. Yeah, you were really good. Very patient. I appreciate that. That's a good quality to have in any person, <laughs> especially teachers. But yeah, I had a good time. This place is pretty good. The part that I didn't expect from this whole thing was how you move around when you're not snowboarding. Like when you have one foot strapped in mm -hmm. and then the other one is not strapped and you just kind of have to like, Hop like you're off. on a scooter. Mm -hmm. That, I, I didn't expect for that to hurt so much. Mm -hmm. My calves were burning. That's a workout. Yeah, nobody ever expects that. Even I didn't expect it and then I like, I did it for a, a while and I was like, wow. Yeah. That hurts. Yeah. Let's get burgers. Successful day. Goodbye. <laughs>